What's up? Chad Otterstrom, Academy Snowboards. We are here with Mint Tours at the Omo 7 Hotel in downtown Asahikawa. Asahikawa. I'm gonna wax my snowboard today. It's Sunday. Everybody's showing up to shred today. We're gonna ride Monday through Friday. The weather is looking amazing. Super excited. This is actually episode 16 of Still Talking. I'm really moving along this winter. We're gonna end the episodes maybe in July when my winter ends. But yeah, 16, two a week. One every Monday, one every Friday. So tune in, Academy Snowboards, Mint Tours. We're gonna to show you where all the goods are in Japan. I'm riding the Academy Master Series. 155, this is one of my favorite boards in Japan, or to ride in Japan. We got some locals walking around, obviously. Sorry, I'm a little insecure, but this board's awesome. Just micro camber, early rise, nose and tail, gives you the perfect amount of float, perfect amount of control. There's a lot of these big floaty Japanese powder boards that are great and fun, but for me, they're kind of like riding pontoon boats. I want a little more control, a little more action going down the hill. But yeah, I'm gonna wax it. The first thing you wanna do when you wax, is loosen your bindings. You get dimples in your board. You got crying babies, sorry. We got dimples in your board. Sorry, it's a distraction. I don't normally have crying babies when I wax my board. <laughs> Anyways, you get dimples in the base of your board, so you wanna loosen your bindings up so you get a smooth base. This hotel is awesome, the Omo 7. Hotel downtown Asahikawa has one of the best wax waxing stations in the world right there at the hotel, which uh, you go anywhere else in the world, they don't have that sweet of a deal. So I'm gonna get I got some bluebird wax. Cold weather wax. It's constantly cold here in the North Island of Japan, so just your average cold weather wax is gonna work. You wanna take an iron? And really spread it out. You can also go like this, save wax. Make sure all the pores become filled in. This is the goal. This is a centered base, so you want all the pores to fill in. A centered base is a porous base. This is the Academy Master Series, like I said, the Chris Roach Master Series. Super fun snowboard. You always want to wax your nose and tail high up on the edges or on the ends when you're in Japan because you're going to be riding deep powder, so you don't want to get, you know, any drag there. You know, circular motion. Cold weather wax requires a little hotter of an iron because it's it's hard wax, which is harder to melt. Tech tip, just letting you know. You also want to scrape it off a little quicker too because when you scrape cold weather wax, it, it tends to chip off as opposed to scrape off. And if you scrape it when it's slightly warm, you'll have a little more hold in those pores. And the more you wax the board, the harder it gets, the stronger it gets, the faster it gets, because all those pores continue to hold the wax as opposed to falling out. Serious business here, you know? I don't mess around. I used to be a professional snowboard coach, and I had to make sure that all my athletes, they call them, went really, really fast in the half pipe and slope style. And I got pretty stressed out trying to do that all the time. So now I'm a guy in Japan, you know, cruising around in powder, hanging out with adults. It's a good time. Like I said, this is the Academy Master Series. I'm gonna sell you on it. If you come to Japan and you want a ripping snowboard that will not fail on you, this is the board for you. We make them at Never Summer down in Denver. They are insanely durable. They, uh, it's hard to beat them up. They're gonna flex at the end of the winter the same as they did at the beginning of the winter. I can ollie onto picnic tables with this thing. The other day I wasn't ollieing so good because I ate a lot of food the day before, but normally when I'm back in Aspen and I'm on point, I can jump completely over picnic tables. So it's all the pop I really need. So it's a great snowboard. All right. Like I said, this is an amazing wax station. We are here with Mint Tours. 
they picked the best hotel room in town, or hotel in town, for snowboarding, basically. Tons of snowboarders stay in here, so you're always going to have someone to hang out with. Even skiers, if you want to hang out with them. But anyways, you wax your board, get all the pores, and then you, you do a scrape. You want to get all of the wax off, everything. If you have excess wax, it's going to drag. If you live in Summit County, you can just kind of go ride the hill, and the groomer there will scrape off the wax for you. But not in Japan. Powder does not come off or make the wax come off like it does in Colorado. You want to make sure you get it all off. You're gonna wanna fully scrape her good. And then you take the scotch guard, quick buff, clean off all the wax scrapings and wax powder. I like to just give it a good sweep. And then once you get all that off, you can kind of see the spots that have little wax spots that you didn't get off, and you just kind of put your finger there and Rub it in, that'll pull the rest of the wax off. This is just your basic wax tech. I'm not like a super professional. If you want a professional instruction, go back on the Academy YouTube page. And we went to Monocera and Dillon, Colorado, and they will give you the VIP how to completely wax a board. This is just what I do every day here. So you do the little Scotch guard, and then you take a a brush and then you brush it downhill, put some structure in your base. That also takes some of the excess wax off. You want to do that every day while you're here in Japan. You don't want to be going slow. Travel all the way here to ride powder. You don't want to mess with it. So do that and then flip your board back over. Tighten your bindings. Like I said, if you come to Japan, you come snowboarding, the Academy Master Series is the board that you want. You want to sign up for Mint Tours. I hear they are already booking out. So now is a good time to look into signing up for next year. You know, soon enough when things get really popular, there could be a couple years booked out. So you want to get in while you can because like I like to say, you're going to have the time of your life. So bindings are tight. Academy Master Series, Mint Tours, Omo Hotels, best waxing stations in the world. See you on the next episode.